Hello, this is Franz from Berlin based Punktronics, and here's a quick video on how to create a velocity responsive, dynamic, synthesized hi hat sound in VPS Avenger. What we want to achieve here is a hi hat sound that reacts to velocity to simulate the degree of openness as well as brightness, decay, and pitch. To pull this off, we're going to use one of Avenger's oscillators, first with the noise generator function, then with the sample player, and velocity as our main modulator. This will give us a very dynamic instrument with a lot of room for experimentation, like this. I prepared a simple hi-hat pattern beforehand, I set a very high velocity range here to take full advantage of the whole scale and here are the synths respond to extreme values. I also applied a bit of MPC swing. We'll start by initializing the patch. I'll switch these send effects off and turn these modulations down for now to start from a clean slate. To simulate a hi-hat sound, we need a generator with very rich harmonic content. That's why I'll use the noise generator. I'll turn down the volume of the main generator here and turn the noise up. Remember that with the inner knob, you can choose between pink, white and brown noise. Right mouse click and drag to taste. Now here's the trick. First, I want to turn the sustain level all the way down. I want to take care of the attack part of the transient, and to do so, I'll modulate the decay time with velocity. A setting of around 15-20% will do. Then if I modulate the release knob again with velocity, I can have the tail of the sound simulate the openness of the hi-hat. So with the amplifier release set to zero, I assign velocity as a modulator and turn the multiplier to 100%. Now we're getting somewhere already. One thing I notice is that when the hi-hat is open, it's not automatically cut by the next hit like a real hi-hat does because it's definitely not a polyphonic instrument. We can fix it from the voicing tab, setting the oscillator to max one voice, making it monophonic. Sounds cool to me. As you can imagine, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Just think of other parameters to modulate to make this sound more expressive and closer to the real thing. For instance, physics tells us that the harder you hit something, the louder and brighter it sounds. So here we can modulate the volume, that's pretty standard stuff. And here the low pass filter using always velocity as a modulator. From here you go ahead and experiment with other parameters like voice spread, pitch, macros and whatnot. Let's hear it with kick and snare for a second. Now, as you can see, this basic technique can be used with a whole lot of other synths or samplers, but the flexibility of Avenger allows us to pull this off in a particularly efficient and elegant way. For instance, every oscillator in Avenger can load samples, so why not load one of these included factory organic noises and see what happens. Turn noise down and the main generator back up. One particularly cool knob is this one which randomizes the starting point of the sample every time it's triggered. And don't forget up here the high pass filter. We can scroll to other samples with these buttons here, if we're in for some experimentation maybe. This is one of our favorites, Motor 1. 
life. And we can even mix and match samples and noise for even more harmonic content. Let's hear it with the bass just for fun. Now it's only a matter of writing some cool patterns and play around with velocity to be on our way to blast those hats all over the place. And that's basically how we do dynamic hi-hats in our Puntronic productions here in Berlin on VPS Avenger. If you find this useful, please subscribe and if you have any requests for a future video, feel free to leave a comment below. Until the next time, Puntronics out. Thanks for watching.